All right, so how's it going, everyone? Back playing some Hogwarts. And I did just do the potions class thing. It was just literally a cutscene. They didn't even talk. I just they just showed everyone just making some potions. How are your assignments coming along? Also, I was I testing something on the recording. So. Professor. Good. Also, no one's watching. You should so be ready to no learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Learn to pulso. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Oh, that's why. Well, I don't think there's been a Y yet. You've got it now. If you'd like, like to the practice, harder difficulties, I think you should you'd fail or something. Perhaps oh. best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Uh, what's the new one? Pulsar. Tells many types of objects. Here. Feels no direct code. Like can be launched in the oh oh that'll be helpful with the object. Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spell casting. T Vanishing charm is a first spell that pushes. What about your books? Still at it, I see. Well. Repetition can be an excellent feature. Okay. Now what? What about... Oh, flying class. That was the one time I was just a little about to say. That. Did we have that before or did we just get that? I kind of want to do all these keys, but maybe I'd do them like... Except for the last one. Record that one, because that'd be pretty boring doing 12 different... Plus, I don't know where they all are. Yeah, I was wondering about flying class. Will we unlock a broom class? Um, is it outside or? Honestly, you should probably, it's probably like a better idea to walk to like all these places within the castle because there's so much Collectible stuff to do, like all those flying keys that uh, find more of the flu things that uh, I can't even think of all of them right now. <laughs> the flying books, the puzzle things. They're just cool. There's a lot of them. Oh, it's raining? I can barely see the rain. Oh, there's a statue right here. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Who do you think will fall from their broom first? Everybody grab a broom and Everybody. we shall <laughs> get started. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Welcome. Hello. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, what? and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Yay! Not a fan, I take it? <laughs> now, let's see how well everyone Boo. kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up. 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 Thank you. Now, your turn. <laughs> Wait, what was it? Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. I was gonna say, am I up. gonna say it? One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. 
a side saddle. That'd be cool. Give me a gun. Run around. There's a mitt with a fucking snitch. And if you hear my whistle while you're in I forget fight, the kid's glasses. Round yourself at once. Wait, what'd you say? I was pissed off at the kid. Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each Ooh. ring in the courtyard. Do take care. Whoa. The brooms are school property. I want them returned in one piece. We're gonna take some use to, I think. I mean, we're not hauling ass. Ah. <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa. I think I'm getting the hang of this. <laughs> this is brilliant. How cool would this be? <laughs> like. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? I am not acclimatized. Like, we're. This next set of rings Old will take you around street. the grounds for more of a challenge. Whoa. You crash. No. Oh. Nope. Fly through the rings and the what ring? Oh. For some reason I want it, I want it to be like inverted. What a view! <laughs> Hello. Nice day for a fly. Everett, that's the idiot. Dude, these kids ha! suck. Good. I've got this. Oh, it's like weird because it turn the camera with the right stick, uh, but then also the, the up down. House. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as the first year. They better take us on the train. That's like the cool, like one of the coolest parts of Harry Potter. Whoa, our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. A <gasps> fucking kraken? I'll take it down. I've played Sea of Thieves. With my friend Tommy, he's a pro Sea of Thieves. He <laughs> shit on the Kraken. <laughs> this is rather fun. Oh. This is pretty cool. This kind of weird, but. <laughs> well done. Over time, moment. we'll get used to it. I see. Hey, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. I but I'm getting some ahead stupid of myself. Thing. We met in the common room. I'm Everett Clopton. So, yeah, you're losing. to join me for a bit of high flying fun? <sighs> Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Does it make you do it anyway? Even if the you say no? <laughs> is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. We're gonna buzz the tower. Uh, I don't. I really don't like that. The. Nice to get above I don't know how else you would do it though. But the camera is also the right stick. Ahead of the gardens. The Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? Here's something He's handy. Barely to faster. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. What do you lean for? Oh. <laughs> now that's, oh, that's more like it. You sure balloons. you're not part hippogriff? There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And <laughs> the Owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. Stop showing the Quidditch area if it's not in the damn game. Like, what the hell? That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Oh, what the hell? Looks like she's already dismissed class. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. 
dismount here. Where? That's pretty cool. I don't know how else you could do the camera. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. Right. I don't even know why I'm here, Professor. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. <laughs> She could see it the whole time. She's cool. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. No regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint, which is in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Test new model. If I could afford the new Bright Spark broom at Spint, which is, I'd be on it now. We go buy a broom and just always fly now. I've not forgotten about our library venture. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. Right. I know a discreet place near there. Good day to you. I require oh, assistance that? with a delivery. Thought you might be interested. Please visit I me turn like my potions, Harry Potter beeper like off. Like... A few coins. Please meet me in the What the hell is going on? As soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies away from prying eyes and distractions. Oh, is it going to be that cool room? What's it called? Where it's like you imagine what you what want you before you now? walk in kind of thing. Is that a mirror? What's this? Secret room requirement. Oh, Captain just woke up. Conrad Vanessa. Demanding delivery. Check this out, I guess. Is this in Hogsmeade? Yeah, because we went. Oh, what happened? Where was the. That one. I remember there was, there was a broom shop. Is it going to have the flying Nimbus? 3000 or whatever, is that what it's called? Is that Nimbus Goku's Cloud? I'll look that up. I, I know, I'm pretty sure. More cozy than Hogsmeade. It is Nimbus 2000. Wasn't it like 3000 the whole time? I don't think I've ever realized that until just now that. Is this that Goku's cloud called Nimbus? The flying Nimbus, yeah. It's a good thing we have auras. Never realized that until literally. Until almost I'm 34 years old, I didn't realize. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? I was today years old when I realized that. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. 
and I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Uh... You said disrupted trade routes caused you... Right then, back to... Get Sounds a quite the array of brooms. How what much, are we looking though? for today? 600. That item is of the highest quality. Oh, I like that one. It's got the lantern. Wait, do they all have lanterns? No. That item is of the highest quality. Oh, that one quality. looks cool as hell. Hey, Captain. That item is of the highest quality. I kind of like that one though. Fire house front. That item is of the highest quality. Finally crafted from. That item is of the highest quality. Aren't those bags like right where your legs would be? I guess you sit a that little forward. Is Dude, shut up, Alby. This one kind of looks the best, though. I'm sure everyone gets that. Go with this. Sure, we'll get it. You'll be thrilled with that broom. broom I promise anyway. you. We find like broom skins. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly I want CS:GO cases, but instead of gun skins, class, it's broom skins. They all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer now. who might be interested in, say, some enhancements. Go on. Ha! Knew I was Loot right box about mechanics you. in my I think Harry you'll be Potter. quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As uh. it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal Clever situation girl. for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? <laughs> Sounds as if you took Kagawa's class. I did, but my focus on the technical elements of brooms rather than the art of flying drove her mad. <laughs> she thinks it fitting I run spint witches now. I don't reckon either of us ever pictured me batting away bludgers for the cannons or puddle me United. And I find a certain satisfaction in winning over the. What about for the Miami Dolphins Quidditch team? To run this shop, with your help. I can continue proving myself the most knowledgeable purveyor of wizarding sporting goods around. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. Uh, Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Learn when you can. Ah, <sighs> can't help but admire Mr. Weeks's enthusiasm. <laughs> That's shiny. Revelio. I know there was like a thingy guy right there. Or is that what makes... Oh, damn it. Is the bell ringing thing whenever there's one of the flyers around? Pages? Oh, I see the no flying symbol, I think. That's a bottom left leg. A 
crack this one. Complete the tasks I've given you, and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defender, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Cut people, dude? What's this one right here? Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. Uh. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. Uh. She sounds annoying. I'd rather not deal with difficult people, but for a reward, I think I can manage. Indeed. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Oh, I see a thingy back there. Wait, did he give us four? Where are we supposed to be going? Oh! What the hell? Well, we may as well go this way. Got things to discover. Um. All the purple, I guess. <laughs> this is why I don't want to play this damn game. Cause like. I wanted to do is all the stuff I want to do. Like I was picturing at, like I'd play like at least one or two of the other video games I have, out of like probably fifteen. Hogsmeade, here I come. And then use this as like a, re a reward, L B and B. Wait, you have entered an area that allows us to press L B then tap B to. Let's use a potion. Oh, it's, you have to hold it? Can I reload my save? I don't know what. Hopefully we got a auto save. Doesn't it usually tell you? A minute ago. I feel like that should be like right when we locked out of the door, right? No, I wanted to treat this game as like a reward. <laughs> For beating like a couple of the games. I knew this was gonna happen, that we're just gonna wanna only play this. Oh, purple's there. There's too many damn mini games. I definitely gotta beat a bunch of these games before like June. I know that. Cause uh what's a Diablo 4? Street Fighter 6. I don't know how much I'm gonna play of that. I don't know. I'm I don't know. I really like Street Fighter 4. 5 didn't I don't know what it was about 5. I did I like did not really enjoy it. I didn't play that much of it. And I had made like several videos of Street Fighter 5. There's some stuff down there. Levitate two enemies. Yeah. 
we're going together. You're a tree pound, dude. My fault you're a deadly great spider. It's true. I don't know, there just wasn't something there's just something about Street Fighter 5 that I just didn't like. I know, because I'm pretty sure wasn't there like a lot of launch problems? Because I I bought that on PC, because wasn't it PlayStation only besides PC? I'm pretty sure six will be Xbox. I should buy it on PC again. So that I can use I mean, I could use my fight stick on Xbox, but I'm pretty sure I have to buy a $40 adapter to be able to play my Xbox 360 fight stick on Series X. That's why I never really played any fighting games for Xbox One, even though there really wasn't. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. You can't imagine I was wanting to try out Kingdom, was it King of Fighters? Never face my old daughter again. That's been out for like, at least a year now, I'm pretty sure. There was another one that it was like, it was cool Is looking. Is there something I can help you with, Mr. What the hell was it? Adley. It was PlayStation Edgar only? Adley. Uh, no. I guess PC no, also. I don't think so. Last Milo and his mad schemes. I could Milo? play it because I have a he PS4. Came to me a pretty few sure the same adapter that would work to use my 360 play stick on the Xbox Series X would also work for the Forbidden Forest. 360 stick on no PlayStation. To procure venom from a living what the hell was it called? It was like Not a cool fighting game. He didn't deserve to go like that. I'm very sorry to hear uh, about your friend. Oh, thank no one's you. watching this for 27 minutes in this video. But... Milo's body is still in that cave with the Absconder. Annoy me. The Absconder? Aye, Milo's name for the Acromantula. I did have a flair for the dramatic. DNF duel. In fact, as he died, Milo begged me to take his heirloom pocket watch. That looked watch, really cool. So that his daughter would have something to remember him by. But I... I fled. If I have time, I can try to collect... You can't possibly... Please, forget. I was talking about it all. The Absconder's Cave. Covered here. Let's go. Is that one quest? Yeah, we still don't know how to dive. That cave's like all the way back. Now, where could that Acromantula cave be? I feel like all those balloons are supposed to be in a row for somewhere or something. I'm not gonna bother with them yet. Well, there's a bunch of enemies. I wanna like fight people. <laughs> yeah, we finally got the broom. What is it, like 10 hours into the game? Oh, that looks so I bet you on PC there's like a photo mode or something. It looks so cool. Even though it's like a low resolution ringer. That's a, that's like the only thing I'm seeing. Like a, I guess it's a complaint kind of thing, but I guess maybe because it's since it's just such a big game, you know? Like, I, like the graphics are okay. But I'm seeing people being like mind blown and stuff by it. I've always said that Which I think it's more so the combined. Whoa, we can see Hogwarts and all the stuff we've always read about and stuff, you know, kind of thing. But like, this, I don't know. They're just graphics.
I was like, I'm playing it in 1440p in the Series X, but I'm recording it at 1080. Could it be a Merlin trial? Merlin trial. I wonder right. who lives here. Handy cool, resource find indeed. Cool. Your field guide. Is the Merlin trial this thingy? Those are kind of cool. Looks I'd like there's a bunch of stuff to do. If you could help me and yeah. my friend with a time sensitive bit of. Yo, this would be so cool. Oh, <laughs> oh what's here? Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Guessing there's somewhere to start for these balloon trial thing. Oh, I'm guessing that's like a trial. Is that part of the Imelda thing? Merlin. Okay. What the hell is that? Other oh, dead people thing. Zombies. Alright, we're gonna stop it here. We're getting gone very long in this recording. Always thanks for watching, hopefully you enjoyed.